alleged inducement of judges, Kano Attorney General runs into trouble. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. The Kano State Attorney General Haruna Dedidi appears to have run into trouble as the All Progressive Congress APC has given him 48 hours ultimatum to retract to give evidence that the appeal court justices that delivered judgment and Kano governorship were compromised. The party also called on Deidere to mention names of those who allegedly interfered in the judgment or faced legal action. Kano APC State Chairman Abdullahi Abbas gave the ultimatum in a petition dated November 23rd and addressed to Deidere. Abbas said in the petition titled Injurious, Malicious and False Statement Against the Judiciary and Our Party on a live television program and a voice note going round in the social media demand for retraction. He recalled that on the 23rd November 2023, the Dairy featured on Channel Television Breakfast Show, wherein he made damaging and serious allegations of corruption against the judges of Akano State Governorship Election Petition Tribunal and the justices of a Court of Appeal that had and determined the appeal of Awa Yusuf and the new Nigerian People's Party NNPP filed an appeal number CAKNEP GOVKAN 34 2023, Yusuf Abakabar versus APC and 2 ORS. Abbas added that in the said interview, while commenting on the judgment of the tribunal that sacked Yusuf, they dare maliciously and falsely alleged that the decision of the tribunal to deliver judgment via Zoom was because of interference. He said, consequent upon the above, I therefore demand that they come forward and mention the names of those who have hands in interfering with the judgment of the two courts. I beg you, let us hear the chasing shadows. What did they take Nigerians for? You don't they near the time we be saying Nigerians go start to scratch knife for knife for these people. This is no jokes. You no, know, say I don't talk and small, small. And this is not a matter of me citing any, anything. It is a matter of the people having tolerated a lot of bs that they have no they have no i don't know there's actually this video in my mind that i wish i can play it but you know the words there they are cause words and more i feel like playing it but if i play their cause words but now it fits this thing where i won't talk we have tolerated a lot of bs that we have got to the peak of no tolerance of bs again that almost you know there's no space we can no longer take it. Nigerians have gotten to the point where they have lost their patience. They don't have any patience to tolerate any kind of nyamayama, you know, nyamayama stinking attitude anymore. And that time is just small. The difference from now and that time is small. When Nigerians will now say, you know what, whatever wants to happen should happen. Okay, he didn't land into any trouble. He's waiting for anybody that will come his way. Okay, at least have to respect our judges. Don't call them criminals just because the judgment does not favor you. Oga, respect is end, and with Nigerian judiciary, permit me to say they don't deserve it. If they want to end, see, respect is end. If you want to make you get you an adult, this one is not a matter of no. If you want to have respect. You earn it. You don't. It is not deserved. And with the what is going on in the con uh, country today, I kid you not. Politicians and the judiciary, they have. So the thing is, you cannot just come. The Nigerian judiciary now coming out to say, eh, Nigerians are disrespecting them. What? Say no income. Eh? Saying they're disrespecting them. Oga, they never see anything. The real disrespect. We are still cooking it. Uh -uh. The pot still for fire. It has not done. Yes, now. Seeing these people have decided, do you know what they are, these people are doing? Playing on our intelligence. Because Nigerians are too tolerant. You get some places where we say, as the election they finish, you see that presidential. Ah, even government save God, then go swear, say they don't go do that thing we then do again. They go not give them hot hot. I don't mean themselves so fighting themselves. Going directly to those people. 
those people, their family members, as in harassing so to the point where they say they no get another, they must, they, nobody could tell them. Next time, they no go do the two they do. To me, there's, this is not a matter of respecting the judges here. Not even bring it to play. Did the judges respect the wishes of Nigerians? Not even go there, sir. Malobe. Don't ah, ma debe, ra, ra, ra. The judiciary in this country, if time is not taken, will cause a massive violent clash in this country. And I just, see, anytime the clash will happen, I just wish they themselves, they will be targeted. To be honest with you, it is the only way they can learn and they can, yes, they can, Nigerians can end their respect with the citizens. Their seemingly unholy romance with the ruling party must be stopped with immediate effect. Okay. The man called Haruna Dedere have case to answer about what he says about, about appeal court justices. Haruna Dedere is an ignorant of law and an illiterate fellow. I just hope that this man, they don't even stress him. Because to me, they say anybody where they, they say we are picking they, they do anyhow. Or they say we are person they, 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 they talk anyhow. Believe me, person where they, they, they do anyhow as well. Where they make that person they talk anyhow. They are busy chasing shadow. What do APC take Nigerians for? Taking Nigerians for for fools? So even without the Attorney General mentioning it, we know what transpired between corrupt APC government and judges, which made them to be passing court and nail judgment from all quarters. Somebody is saying, if you do have evidence of corruption, provide it. Oh, but let my dear, but let my dear, say you are very sick for saying that. Really? Ah, oh, you're looking for evidence. Don't worry. You see it. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> waiting for evidence of corruption. A fellow citizen is saying it. Some people never learn. No. I've said it before. There are these kind of people that when you see and listen to what they say, and you see what Nigerian government is doing, you say, Amon, these people deserve anything the government is doing. I just wish the government to be focusing on only them so that they can really be enjoying the dividends of this government. Scammer, like this write-up is like the kind of tales to children with the warning of not to tell anyone. APC is taking Nigerians for a ride because the Nigerian armed forces is like tissue paper in their pocket. Nigeria is dead and decomposed. God forbid, the country where I did over decompose. <laughs> we are the Kano people. Let you know that our state is not APC members. We have a right to vote for anyone else who is able and ready to solve our problem in the state. Not the arrogance and terrorist party APC. Up NNPP, up Aba and up Kwanshakia. Up Kwankwasia, oh Kwankwasu. Okay, we don't hear now. All right, on this note, you have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come, you'll be next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.